New crime concerns in Montgomery County as the police chief there says gun crimes are nearly at an all time high. One of those crimes, a shooting here at the Briggs Cheney Marketplace. This is just off of Route 29 last night. Police still trying to track down whoever shot a man and also hit several cars and businesses. Our Darcy Spencer has more on what local lawmakers are doing now to try to stop the increased violence. Businesses have boarded up windows. There is broken glass in the parking lot. Signs of a shooting that happened in this busy Burtonsville area shopping center on Sunday afternoon. Police confirm 60 shots were fired. I feel safe around here. I've never felt unsafe, so I'm really shocked to hear about this. I didn't even know it happened. Very surprised. Very surprised. The police chief says gun crimes have nearly doubled year over year in Montgomery County, and in his words, it's approaching an all-time high. He says it's concerning that more people will have the option to carry guns, with Maryland lifting some restrictions on who can get a permit to carry a weapon in the state after the Supreme Court struck down a similar law in New York. It just shows you that uh, gun violence has become sort of the norm, which is not, I think, where we need to be in, in, in today's environment. Council President Gabe Albernos is introducing legislation that would make it illegal for those with gun permits to carry within 100 yards of a place of public assembly in the county, such as places of worship, malls, and concert venues. We want to make sure that our general public understands that we are here to protect you, and someone's Second Amendment right should not supersede someone's ability to feel safe. Just last week, county police recovered these two guns after a shooting and chase that ended with a crash in Virginia. The chief says it's not unusual now to find 30 to 60 rounds being fired in a shooting scene. In Burtonsville, one person was shot. Many of those rounds hit businesses and cars. So I had no idea there was a shooting and I don't know if it would have changed how I felt. I would have come anyway and just I just feel like we just need to live our lives and be ready and if it's our time to go then it's our time to go you know albernos says he plans to introduce that legislation on tuesday he's hoping it'll pass sometime this month in montgomery county darcy spencer news 4.